Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Lois Morton. I'm going to sing a song for you that is 85% uh, autobiographical. <laughs> <laughs> there I was, in despair I was, so deep in debris, no one knew where I was. And I had to come out of the closet, because I couldn't get into the closet and face a truth so catastrophic, so trace, so diabolic. I had become a clutterholic. I love all my stuff, I'm surrounded by stuff, and I keep accumulating, and it's never enough. I had piles on the piano and piles on the floor. I hadn't seen my tabletop since 94. I read all the books, tried to master feng shui, but I couldn't throw a single piece of paper away. I had Jigsaw puzzles, missing pieces, 40 years of rental leases, baby shoes and old eyeglasses, notes from all my college classes, souvenirs from summer trips and long inspired memberships, hordes of fascinating books and cookbooks by a hundred cooks, little types of little boxes, bits of fur and silver foxes, photos from the Caribbean, from the Dead Sea, the Aegean, bad beats and wires and tools for beating, magazines I plan on reading, socks and gloves that have lost their mate against which I won't discriminate, articles I never read, and 50 hats on a styrofoam head. I reached from the bottom and I ran to the phone Someone help me, I cried, I cannot do this alone And before I could ponder which things to hide An organizing specialist was by my side he had more manila folders than ever I'd seen And then he revealed his wondrous labeling machine I'm in love with the man with the labeling machine He trimmed has my life, keeps my surfaces clean There's really nothing to it, he makes me want to do it The man with the labeling machine, he said you are not hopeless, not a wit. You're merely stuck in piles of stuff. <laughs> These things are simply out of place. When you give them a name, they will have a space. So he cranked up those labels categorically, progressively reducing my anxiety. Yes, he cranked up the labels, one, two, and three, and pretty soon he even put a label on me. I'm addicted to folders, it's plain to see. I'm just the other side of OCD. <laughs> no longer adrift in miscellaneous piles, I've acquired filing cabinets that go on for miles. And I'm in love with the man with the labeling machine. He trimmed tabs my life, keeps my surfaces clean. There's really nothing to it, he makes me want to do it. But there's something missing, you know what I mean? I need a guy with a shredding machine. <laughs> Well, I wrote that song, which is part of 85% of the